Morning guys, um, so this is me trying again to start vlogging. Um, I definitely want to get better at it and a lot more consistent. So for today, since it is Saturday, I'm super excited that I'll actually be going to a um, Saturday Zumba class. So one of my favorite instructors used to be um, teaching her Saturday class in a neighborhood across the street. Um, but since I've started working, it's been really difficult to kind of get my exercise routine together. So um, today she officially has her Saturday class moved over to my neighborhood. So I'm starting off my day with that. Um, and then I wanted to kind of vlog um, other parts of my day today. So I think we're gonna go to the grocery store. Um, I do wanna show some of my meal prep. Um, that I like to do every Saturday. That way I am ready to go the rest of the week. Um, and I'm not stressing about what I'm gonna pack for lunch for work. Um, because if I don't need to be spending money on food, that's definitely an area I wanna work on. Um, and so yes, if I can prep ahead of time, that's better. So, but yeah, I will take you with me kind of throughout my day for a couple of things that we're doing today. And hopefully this will be kind of more of a consistent thing. So as you can see, I have the outfit on and I don't know what it is today, but I'm kind of feeling like pink and purple with the pink sports bra that you guys saw. And then also my purple socks. And we are an Under Armour family, so I've got Under Armour um, shirt. And also you can't see it, but I have some Under Armour um, white sneakers as well and always like a little sum sum because once again I'm always getting a ton of things from Bath and Body so I spritzed a little bit of my strawberry pound cake body spray before heading out um, and look that's pink too I don't know what's going on um, but other than that um, still on the pink train I'm going to be packing my pink uh, backpack I have like two backpacks that I like to bring as like my gym bags um, so I like to keep, whether that's chafing stick, chapstick, lifting gloves, water bottles, obviously my glasses, wallet, things of that nature. Um, but I'm going with my pink backpack as opposed to my black one. And then I'm gonna continue with the pink and use this as my, basically a water cup, my water bottle for today. So other than that, I'll continue to take you with me um, as I hit the road, which is, literally in my neighborhood like the rec center is in my neighborhood so um i'll be there in no time but i will be leaving my house in a little bit um just want to make sure that all of my dogs have fresh water before i walk out so other than that um, i'll see you guys again soon okay so i'm finally home from zumba and i really wish i had a chance to film a little bit about the class um, just to get a feel, but if you know Zumba, it's so much fun. And like I said, this is one of my favorite instructors who's moved to Saturday. And her moves are really good. Like her choreo, like you'd probably want to take them to the club, okay? It's not like the, it's not moves that seem like way too athletic, like aerobic-y, I guess that's the word. Um, and I don't really feel like awkward doing them. It's so much fun, but I really wanted to walk there. I um, wanted to get back into walking to the rec and then doing my workout, but with the rain and everything, it was a good thing I didn't because it really did in fact start raining when we were finished. Um, but it was so good to see everybody since I honestly haven't been to a class with everybody since November, since I started my new job. So I'm hoping this will be a nice routine on the Saturday. Um, but I am just unpacking my backpack it's a good thing I brought this because it's basically, it feels like it's winter, like truly. It feels like it's winter, um, even though it's in May, and it's just like really wet and it's cold. Um, I think that's pretty much it, but I need to unpack from here. I think I've decided that the body spray that I packed, that's pretty much going to be in this bag. And I think it's safe to say that I have enough body spray, just like I have enough chapstick, for example, that like one can go into every bag that I own. <laughs> I can't be the only one, you know? Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it for, I think my exercise, like 
We were thinking of going back to the rack and kind of doing more of a um, weightlifting workout because that was just solely cardio. Um, my boyfriend went to went into work, so technically I think he's kind of on call, I guess you could say. Um, because the weather's crappy, I'm probably just going to stay in. Um, but other than that, I'm going to get my heart rate down, focus on drinking my water that I had packed in class. I still have some more left. Um, read a little bit of my book. Right now I'm reading a Stephen King book called Dreamcatcher. Let me know if you know what that is. Um, I'm pretty much a fan of all of Stephen King. I think he, I've always enjoyed reading ever since I was little, but starting to read his books when I was um, years ago, like as a teenager, um, there was just something about the way his type of reading, uh, of writing that I really gravitate towards. So it doesn't really matter what book I grab of his, I'm really into it. And so I'm gonna get my heart rate back down, focus on drinking. everyone so I'm finally back I'm sure you guys saw that uh, we got a little hungry so we ordered Wendy's um, and then we were playing a little bit of cards I was just trying to get my food to digest and I finally took a shower it was much needed um, obviously washed my hair as you can see and I'm about to blow dry it um, but really the main two products that I kind of use after showering um, I have this like hair and body mist actually from Victoria's Secret that's coconut um, and it has hyaluronic acid and vitamin B5 so I kind of just like spritz it walk through it kind of gets in my hair my body um, and I have a honey scent one too um, and then other than that, I have this leave-in conditioner that I do kind of like a dime size, um, sometimes two. And I just put that all kind of throughout my hair. Um, and it's supposed to be their sleek and shine leave-in conditioner from Garnier. And it actually really does that. I really feel like it does help with it being soft and shiny um, until I'm ready to wash my hair again. And I pretty much do it um, not even every other day. I try to have like two days in between um, until I'm ready to wash my hair again. So other than that, that's what I'm gonna do. And then I promise you I will be showing my meal prepping, uh, which I talked about in the beginning of this vlog. So I will be doing that next and that'll probably conclude um, today's vlog. I promise it'll be a lot more exciting next time, but to be continued. So I'm finally going to start meal prepping. And I normally like to do the same portion sizes of my protein as well as my carb. I heard somewhere that it's supposed to be like the size of your palm, but like equal. And then the larger portion is the veg. So these are what my meal prep containers look like. usually like this with so three compartments protein carb and then vegetables go in here yeah, this is a really good thing I do to make sure I'm not wasting any food so my carb this coming week is actually gonna be these grits that I already made I'm not gonna waste any food so this I will try to finish it for carb and then I have two containers here mixed um, brats as well as chicken and then I do have to do some prep 
for the vegetables. So I'm going to actually roast carrots. So I'll, I'll get started on that and then you can see kind of what that all looks like at the end. Okay, so I finally have the carrots. Seriously? If you have dogs, you know what I mean. Um, I finally have the carrots chopped up and I seasoned them with a little bit of vegetable oil, crushed red pepper flakes, some salt and some onion salt. I just kind of grabbed whatever at this point to um, go ahead and flavor them just because my oven was a little bit faster than I realized when it preheated. So it was ready to go really quick. Um, but I have them in there right now at 425 and they're gonna cook for 20 minutes. Um, yeah, and when I get back, you'll see what at least one of the containers looks like for the meal prep. Um, but I typically try to make sure that I'm meal prepped Monday through Friday. That way I can just grab a container ready to go for work. Okay, so the carrots and everything finally finished cooking. And I've put together two meal prep containers. Um, and I'll just flip the camera and kind of show you guys. I will be making this three more times since I have five containers or six, but I just wanted to show you two that I have completed. Here you go. Um, these are the two containers I have. So these will basically be my Monday and Tuesday meals. I got grits, um, some brats that I cooked in the air fryer and seasoned them. And then these are my roasted carrots. So I have some leftover. I have some more leftover sitting in here and I'm gonna keep doing it for the rest of the containers. And that's going to be the end of this vlog. So I'll see you later.